into visions of light and love. This is your reading for the energy in December. This reading is for all of the Tauruses out there, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. If you are a returning viewer, welcome back. If this is your first time stopping by, welcome to Visions of Light and Love. If the reading does not resonate with your situation, check out your Moon, Venus, and Rising Sign videos. Cross watchers are welcome as well. If you like my energy, my vibe, you connect with this reading. And you feel like I'm the reader for you. And you want to show some support to the channel. Hit the subscription link along with the notification bell and the thumbs up image to help this video circulate. If you need something more private, something more specific to your channel, the link to the email address is in the description box below. Okay. Oh, okay. That's the mutual energy. We have love calls and a reverse. I remind you, this is how does your partner feel about the relationship? How do you feel? Okay, so let's see. I will be doing finances for next, next year as well. So your energy will be on the right side. Your partner's on the left. Okay, so this is your energy. Page of Cups. Why is this page of cups here from the sign of Taurus? It's a windy justice card. Libra's energy. Your partner has the four of wands. Okay. Okay. All right. Oh, it's windy. I just hear stuff blowing. All right, so the mute, your your partner's the the status of the relationship. I'm sorry. So you two may not be expressing how you feel about each other at this time. You may be talking. That communication may be to a minimum. If you are talking, you're not really letting each other know how you feel. Taurus, you are. Trying to offer this person a cup of love to balance things out. But I feel like in your mind, you feel like with this justice card, this is Libra's energy. You are feeling as if there is something going on that you are not seeing. And that's, this is how you're feeling, but you're still offering this person love. Your partner, on the other hand, is focused on family, the stability of the relationship. This person could be... Focusing on children. I see two girls and one boy. I'm seeing this person focusing on evolution, focusing on growth, focusing on focusing on taking care of the children and the family and growth. I'm seeing this person, your person is going through a transformation. That's what I'm seeing. This is this is how they feel. They're transforming. They see, they want the relationship. Your partner wants this relationship to, ev to evolve. That's what they want. Okay? While you're offering them balance and what you have to offer them, they, in turn, want stability from you but I feel like this person wants the relationship to change and this person is going through a transformation again this person is going through a transformation and I'm seeing this person taking care of children okay comment below and let me know let's find out what the blockage is what are the obstacles that are blocking this union from going forward what are the obstacles okay okay so we have a stalker here with sunglasses there is someone you could be spying on your partner or they're spying on you you two came into each other's life to teach each other a lesson with their soulmate card okay you have some type of soul contract with this person and you will not be released 
from this until you learn your lesson. And I'm saying again, palm tree growth, stability, being flexible. Tars, you are a fixed sign. You have to be, you are fixed on what you want, but in a relationship, you have to be more compromised and more flexible in order for this to grow. Okay. What other messages are here? What all? What are the other blockages in this union? Okay, maybe that's it. I mean, nothing else is coming out. What are the other blockages? Oh, okay. That's too many. Too, too many. That's the energy of the night. Maybe daytime or evening time in some of your locations, but it's nighttime here. 11 o'clock to be exact. Okay, so someone, yeah, that's why I said someone feels as if the other person is doing something behind their back, like be, having, um, being sneaky, having options or something. I don't feel like that's what it is. But let's see what else comes out. Okay, so that's what it is. Someone needs to heal from something that happened in the past in order for joy to come in. So someone, again, needs to heal from something that took place in the past. Your partner needs to heal from something that took place in the past. That's what it is. In order for this situation to move on to something else. Do you even want this relationship, Taurus? Let's see. Do you want it? Do you even want to be in this relationship with this person? Oh. There's five of pentacles here. That's your energy. So, I'm seeing you wanting to walk away from this. But I, I feel like it's hidden. You want to walk away from this. However, if you walk away from this, there are going to be financial issues. You want to walk away. You want to start over. You want a new stable beginning. But it's blocked right now. It's blocked. Could be because of children. You may have children with this person. I'm seeing like a young adult. With a page of wands. This person has you up at night. Yeah, see... You feel like this person has a secret. You feel like the reason you want to walk away from this is because you feel like there is something going on here that you can't see. You feel like the relationship is a stalemate relationship. It's not going anywhere. It's maybe a friends with benefits and you're ready like because you feel like this person is doing something sneaky behind your back. They're holding you back. You're ready to go. You do love them. And you want them to change, but they're they're taking their time changing. They're not making any change. They um this person may be ignoring the cup that you have to offer. And this could very well be um vice versa. So apply the energy as if it's to your story. But I'm seeing you ready to cut this person off. I'm seeing you ready to cut this person off. You're trying to be strong for the kids if you have children with this person. You are trying to be strong. Could be dealing with a Leo, a Virgo. What other energies are here? A Libra. Another Taurus, a Capricorn. Yeah, you're you're taming yourself. You're you're withdrawing from this um situation at this time because you're trying to gain clarity about walking away. 
but you keep looking back. You keep going back to this person, but you do want to walk. You want to walk away. This situation is toxic. It's not going anywhere. Could be done with a Capricorn, but you have a decision to make, and you're waiting. You're going to make the decision when you're when the time is right for you, but you're waiting right now. person your person is feeling like how does the your Taurus's per, partner feel okay so this person feels like they can be themselves around you some of you been with this person for a long time with those pinnacles that came out maybe six or more years I don't feel like that this is a new, a new union. They do love you. But again, you as I said, you feel like this person is doing something sneaky. Like, you try to offer them love. And to balance things out. And this person is focusing on the children. And they're saying they can't get enough of you. But they also can't do this anymore. So this person is on the fence as well. So I'm going to leave it at that, Taurus. So I'm seeing two people together. They are trying to balance things out for children. One person, you, wanting to walk away. But not because you're thinking about the children. And you want to walk away as also because you feel like your partner had someone else on the side. So I'm going to leave it at that. Taurus, this is your reading for the energy in December. Comment below. Let me know if this is your story. Share, like, subscribe. Hit the notification bell. Be safe. I'm sending love, light, peace, and healing energy. Thank you for watching. Enjoy the rest of your week. And I will see you next time. Bye.